hello. What are you doing back here, Marshy? I was exploring, and I noticed that Rex and Lily were here, and the gates were closed, and I thought they were stuck, so I wanted to try to help them, but it seems like they're fine now, because the gates are open, and I don't see them. I know where they are. Come with me. Just... I don't know. Hmm? Don't let them know that I'm so present. Okay. You're in Sam's house. Sam's house. Where was Sam's Just house? Wait for them to come out or something. I think they're busy with him. Okay. Marshy. Hmm? Am I a... Huh? Am I a bad person? I... I mean... Not fully. I think you have good intentions, it's just... You don't, like, pull them off in the greatest ways. Trying the best I can. I don't know what else I can do for you people. Well, um... I don't know how I'm supposed to... show that I'm trying when... I have to... Talk about this later. Hello. Hey. Are you y'all okay? I noticed- okay, well, I'm really strange. I was just exploring, and I noticed that I saw- I saw you guys here. The gates were closed, and I thought something may have gone wrong, so I tried to help, but then I realized, after circling the place, that the gates were open again, and, uh, I don't know. Oh, things are going wrong, but we're fine. Okay, that's good to know. Have you talked to the people in this town yet? Uh, today? No, but earlier, yeah. Is it just me, or are they, like, all, like, in love with the goddess? I think to... it's, like, some kind of relig religion thing. I mean, yeah, but it's weird to be in a place where people like her for once. Typically, I'm so used to going places and having people talking mad shit on her. Yeah... It's refreshing and also frightening at the same time, because I feel a sense of whiplash from it all. I get that. Kinda. Have you seen her, by the way? The goddess? Um... No. I need to talk to her. I don't know when I'm gonna find the time to see her. Hmm. Uh, well, maybe just... Try... I don't know. Try to contact her in some way? I don't know. She usually you just finds me. You've been to me, right, Marshy? Yeah, no. Hmm. Um. Anyway, if y'all are good, I guess I'll just head out. Unless, I don't know, you want to do something? I'm kind of bored. Uh. He's in a bad mood. Ah, uh, I see. I won't uh, butt into that. Probably personal stuff. Well, come on, are you going to solve everyone's problems in this town or what? Yeah, actually, when you put it like that, that sounds quite lovely. They have- I guess they have daylight sensors? They said there was a storehouse that got robbed, right? Uh... Believe I'm gonna so? guess it's this building back here. No, that thief didn't leave anything behind. What quest are we doing first? I think finding Melody might be the most important one. Yeah, missing kid is kind of not great. Here, it's becoming daytime. Let's go over or there. Or how about a bandit that's still leaving? And yeah, you know, but a missing covering kid. covering the tracks right now. A missing kid isn't going to give uh... us anything. Killing a bandit and taking whatever loot they have on it, now they're... And, you know, if they're just a petty thief, whatever. We get their stuff. If they are an actual bandit... Let me get information. 
And what if the child dies because we don't get there in time or Look, something? Look, you dragged me all the way over here. Can you at least concede me this? Fine. Thank Let's you. Let's just hope the kid doesn't die or something. She chased a hooded figure out of town and towards the south. That doesn't sound... There, you know there's been cultists. All right, what does a cultist have to do with food? Anyway, here are the mountains. Alright, let's start climbing. Psst! Are she? What? What are you guys doing? We're looking for, I believe, a thief? Like a secret hideout where they might be hiding? You know I can go through walls, right? I think I would know if there's a hideout in this area. That's... Well... Is there? No. There's literally nothing here. Why are you guys here? Because we don't know where to go. left the town by now. Hmm? I thought you would have left the town by now. I can't show up around these guys. I've been wanting to do some investigating myself, and I can't exactly investigate my own town if... Rex is there. Where are you? Are you invisible? I'm... You could say that. Hmm. Just... Just, just, Mart, turn around. Fine. Oh, turn visible. Just turn around. Oh. That's why they call you Cat God. Shut <laughs> your mouth. Okay, okay, okay. Right now. Okay, 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 okay. Look, just... Find whatever you're gonna find and then get out. I can't Why? do investigating of my own town if they're here. Why not? Because I can't talk to them. Why not? Because they hate me. Well, then fix that. Yeah, fix it how? Be nicer to them? You speak of impossible things, Marshmallow. Oh my god. Uh, okay, um, well. Uh, there... Okay, fine. I'll give you a... Okay, how about this? You get them to leave if I give you some kind of hint on where whatever thief went. Okay. You're probably looking for someone in a hood, right? Because I saw someone like that run out. Yeah. And then I saw, you know, the rest of the town's people kind of running after them. I didn't help. I didn't really feel... That's a pedestrian matter. Anyway, the point is... I saw them go towards the Autumn Forest, okay? The Autumn Forest, okay. They looked kind of small, too. Okay. Are you sure you're after a thief? Actually, there was also, um... What's her name? Hold on. Melody. She ran off. Oh, shit. They're coming. Okay, just remember what I said. Autumn Get Forest. them out. There's gotcha. your hint. Okay, Autumn Forest. Um, I don't... I have... Mm -hmm. I have intel. What? So, a cat told me... A cat? That we should head to the Autumn Forest. There might be the person we're looking for there. You don't tell me what to do. Uh, okay. By the way, what have you been up to lately, Marcy? How have you been? I've been working on my tree, making it look... Oh, uh, um, hold on, I found a child. Where? You did? Where? Uh, come to the south end. The south end. Okay. And Lila's going in the wrong direction. I am? Turn left. I see Marshy. Well, then follow me. Well, I'm ahead of you. Oh. Well. <laughs> but somehow I'm in the wrong direction? <laughs> this yeah, because you're walking towards the mountain instead of over here. Oh, I was walking in this direction. Then you told me I was going the wrong way. No, you weren't. I literally was. Oh. You were not. There's Melody. Hi. Hey, Melody. Please don't sneak up on me like that. I thought you were a monster. Hey, wait. You visited the town yesterday and now you're back? Uh, how did you find me? Yeah, enough screwing around. How about you scram back home? You know, your, your mom sent us. She's worried about you. Yeah, I, I know. And I'm really sorry to worry her. I just, I have to do this. What are you doing? 
I overheard you telling Raven about that white-haired guy, that, that bandit leader, right? Callum was his name. A long time ago, when I was younger, he came to our village to recruit people against the goddess. One of those people was my brother. I haven't seen him in so long, and I, I just want to make sure he's okay. Melody, tell us about your brother. He was kind. He was the best gatherer our village had. Without him, it's been hard to expand our homes and repair the walls. Even though people in the village turned their backs on him, I never gave up. I know he's out there and he, he's all alone. I just want to at least make sure he's okay, even if he doesn't believe in our home anymore. His name was Sebastian. Hold on. Hmm. Are you the twerp that stole from the Aetherian storehouse? Um, I didn't. I'm sorry about it. I just ain't really need the supplies and it was wrong of me, though I know it was. You can bring everything back to Adarin. I'm sure Vix is angry. You know, Melody, I know where your brother is. Y you do? Well, is he safe? Is he happy? Does, does he remember me? He's with me in Vanguard. Oh, thank goodness. Hey, could you give this letter to him? Tell him it's for me, please. I just want to know that that I'm okay. I hope that's not too much work for you. I, I want to stay in touch with my brother. I'm glad to hear he's okay. It kind of is too much work for us. Well, I uh, think no we, just me. Thank you. Really. I'll head back to Adrian. Just get my brother that letter, okay? Thanks again. Goodbye. All right, let's get these stolen goods back. You guys ready? Mm-hmm. All right, let's head back. No, I need some need some lithium crystals. <laughs> I need to pop back to Vanguard to grab those. What are you grabbing? I'll be back. What was he grabbing? Uh, vitium crystals? Vitium? Oh dear. For the flux, dude. You're not learning flux, right, Marshy? Um, no. Not, not flux, but other things. Good. Because it seems oh like Oh my he's... god, thank god he's... Oh, hey! Fuck. What? Candy? Yeah, nope, bye. Sorry, uh, didn't know you were here. What do you... How did you not know? Candy, I know you've been here the whole time. No, I haven't. Yes, you have. No. Then who gave the info to Marshy, huh? Some other cat, obviously. Yeah, I'm sure, I'm I sure, I speak yes. fluent cat, as you mm -hmm. know. And you lied to me earlier. No. Okay, don't blame Marshy, I told her to. Why? I thought we were starting to get along. Because I didn't want you and Rex knowing I was here. What? I wouldn't tell him if you wouldn't want me to. Yeah, well, it's kind of hard to avoid him and you. Oh. Well, At the I very least, if I avoid the both of you, then it's automatically avoiding him, right? That's like transitive property or something. I don't think it... Yeah, but you're my friend. Really? Yeah. And as your friend, I'm worried about you. This was left <sighs> at my house. There's no need for you to worry. I'm kind of God, remember? You should take and read that. It was left from Callum. He broke into my home. Callum? Did he leave a mess behind? No. Just the book. Oh, he asked good. me to be finally dear learned, and give it to you. Finally learned manners. I suppose. I don't know if breaking into someone's home could count as manners when I have... No, wait, I don't have a mailbox. Fuck. Shit, I shouldn't swear in front of a god. Fuck! Okay, this is going in a south direction. 
I'm back. Um. Hey! Where are you? Huh? I'm in the city. Oh, um, we are, we're oh, on well, the way, we're, we're on the way here, back. We were waiting we got for you where you left up. us. Yeah. Oh, uh, I figured you would have left without me. What? No, we waited for you. Ugh. Oh. Sometimes I forget that you don't think the same way. And what does that mean? You think about yourself first in fourth rows. And there's nothing wrong with that. But... Sure. She constantly thinks about everyone except herself first. And there's nothing wrong with either way. Well, I mean, there. no, there's nothing wrong with either way. It's fine. It's just different mindsets. So if you were in our situation, you would have went back to the town and not waited for us. But since we were in a situation and Marshy always puts other people first, she did wait. See how that works? There we go. Oh, lovely. Perfect. Okay, we leave or enter. All right, let's go to Vix first. Hey, Vix. We uh, have your goods. Oh. I see you found our stolen rations. Good. I'm glad to see an outsider has decent work ethic. You've done a moderately good service to us. Don't think that means you're a member of Adarin for that, though. There are many more things you must prove before I will accept you. But thank you. We've returned the stolen goods to Vix, and she seems to tolerate our existence for a bit more than before. Oh. Okay. What um, about... Snow was it? Who was yeah, we can for? try talking to her. Oh, hey, it looks like Melody's back. Aw. She's faster than us. Hey, yeah. Snow! Thank you, thank you so much for finding my daughter. Never, ever leave this town again, Melody. You worried me sick. This world isn't safe out there. Melody would give a weak smile. I'm sorry, Mother. I won't do it again, okay? You reunited a family! Now, given what Melody told you, maybe it's time you reunite them again. You have a letter to deliver. Oh, sweet. Oh, <gasps> We got cake! Well... Called Experiment 1. That's a little <laughs> sus. <laughs> that's actually... That's a... Hmm. Terrible thing to name a piece of cake. I'm, I'm low-key terrified. Alright, well, we can leave now. Isn't that lovely? Yeah, you can start making your way out. I gotta handle something real quick. Oh, okay. Great. Okay. The cake is a lie. It might be. It might be poison. Don't eat the cake, Marcy. I'm gonna eat the cake. But it I'm looks good. <laughs> it does look really good. It's from the Twilight Forest. Isn't that okay. the forbidden place? Let's oh, go. Oh, yeah. Did you really give him stuff to get flux? Come on. I know you're okay with hurting yourself, but are you really okay with giving someone the means to hurt them? Um, I think as long as he's teaching them how to be reasonable with it, it's okay, maybe? You don't understand. That kid we talked to, Marshy, he doesn't understand reason. He just wants to use Flux and get it as quick as possible. That's... That sort of mentality is just waiting for something to go wrong. That's not safe. He's gonna destroy himself. And Rex, as much as I appreciate you, you're not the type to prevent him from killing himself. I kind of take the blame on this one a little bit. I kind of convinced Rex to teach him. What? I thought that maybe if no one were able to teach him, he'd get himself into more trouble, but apparently it didn't go as do planned. Do you understand Rex's teaching approach? It's a, I didn't... here, take this and do it yourself. I didn't know that. Basically, it, all you did was enable the kid to do thousands of things worse, because at least he would have had to find the stuff on his own before. Now he just gets it handed to him and he teaches himself. Uh, me? Yikes. Mercy. Look, I didn't realize that Rex wasn't a great teacher. Okay, you lied to me once today. Why- don't do it again. Why does that kid want to learn Flux? Oh, I don't... 
Wait, did he explain? I don't remember if he explained it or not, to be completely honest. Rex? You Sorry, just... I just felt something. Huh? Oh, I remember now. The kid... He wants to bring his brother back from something. This actually might be a lot worse than I thought it was. Percy? Huh? Did you hear that? Hear what? Were you listening? What? Are you okay? What? I... Not there. Where is he? I need to go home. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Did you hear what I said? What? So what? What did you? That what did kid. You say? He wants to bring his brother back from something, or avenge him. I don't know. Something about I, his brother. He can do that. I. 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 It's not my place. I. I need. To, I need to go home. How far are we? Um. Okay. Um. This way. Uh. I'm sorry, Marcy, to cut this short. I. I need to leave. Oh. I need to, oh.